Hey everybody, you've probably heard about the idea of a Bitmoji classroom. Since we're not going to have actual lockers, I thought it would be fun for us to have a virtual locker and maybe decorate it in the same way that you would if you were lucky enough to have a locker in school. So um, what I've set for you that you'll find this in Google Classroom. This is again, this is just for fun. You don't have to complete this if it stresses you out, but it'll be interesting to see what you come up with when everybody finishes their locker. Um, you can decorate it. So let's say I wanted to insert a pile of books. I, right now I have a pile of books here. So let's say I want to put this in there. Insert. All right, and I just have to resize this. And maybe put that in here. You might have pictures of your family, perhaps. So if you're going to do that, insert image. You might have them in your Google Photos. So here's a picture of my swimming pool. Maybe I want to put that in my locker. Insert. Let's resize it because we all need reminders that there are nice things in this world. So there's my little picture that I'm going to hang in my locker. Um, maybe you have a backpack. Insert image. We're going to search the web for a backpack. All right, so find something that looks pretty much like the one you probably would bring with you to school. How about this one? Insert. And if you don't like the idea, see how it has the white background? One of the things you can do, if you look for an image that's transparent, so if I put in the word transparent backpack, oops, fix that typo. I'll give us ones that have, you know, that where the background won't be white like this one. So how about Try that one and see if that one works. Yeah, that one does. So I'm going to delete this one. And let's put this one where we resize it. And we'll have that hanging in the locker. Now, depending on um, what sports you're involved with, you might want to put in, if you were, if sports were going on, I happen to be a tennis coach and a tennis player. So I think I'd want to put in a tennis racket. So let's look at, see if I can find something there. Search from the web. Let's put in transparent. Let's just stick with those words transparent. Tennis bracket. All right, and the one that's most similar to mine. This one's pretty close to what I have. Insert. All right, so let's resize it and then we're going to flip it around too. Resize it, and then I'm just going to rotate it by doing that so it's standing up in my locker. And that might be a little too big, so maybe a little smaller. Resize that. That's probably more realistic for a locker. All right, so, um, you know, you're going to put in as many things as you want to, but I thought it would be kind of fun for us to put in some stuff um, just to see what, what, would, what, what might your locker look like if we were actually in school. And if you tend to be a neat locker person, then it'd be nice to see a nice neat locker. If you tend to be a little bit on the messy side, you know, don't be afraid to throw in like a, a sweat jacket that you leave in there for months at a time. So I'm kind of curious, you know, think about your year last year. Um, how organized were you? you? know, if you're a fifth grader, you might not have even had a locker last year. Um, so this will be kind of fun to see what you come up with. So just throw in a couple of things, you know, I kind of want to get an idea of what kind of person you are. And I think you can tell a lot about a person by looking at what's in their locker, I think. So put in some things that'll help us to learn a little bit about you and we'll have some fun.